Hi, my name is Natalia DeCock, and I'm a second year biomedical engineering major here at Cal Poly, and today we're going to be talking about what not to do in the lab with gloves on. Gloves are an important part of working in a laboratory because they create a barrier between ourselves and the materials that we're working with. It's important to wear gloves when working with high molarity solutions as well as skin irritants. Today we're going to be working with 6 molar hydrochloric acid. One thing that's important to remember when working with high concentration acids or bases is that harmful residues will stick around after the experiment is complete. Imagine that you're working with your acid and pouring it into a graduated cylinder when you manage to spill it on the counter. Here you can see Natalia cleaning up the acid spill. This is the incorrect way to go about cleaning up an acid spill. This is because although Natalia has gloves on, she has not neutralized the acid that she was working with, which has a very high concentration. Also, she has not told her professor about the spill. With her glove still on, you can see Natalia here following correct laboratory procedures and neutralizing the acid that she has spilled and then proceeding to wipe it up with a paper towel. After she has cleaned up her spill completely, Natalia goes to tell her professor about the spill. Here you can see Natalia typing on her phone with her contaminated gloves on as well as later taking a call. Notice that Natalia still has her gloves on from after cleaning up the acid spill. These gloves have harmful residues on them, which she touches her phone with and then she puts up to her face. This can cause skin irritation. She also touches the door handle, which can not only affect her, but affect many others that will touch the door handle after her. Here you can see her following correct laboratory procedures as she removes her gloves before handling her phone or leaving the room. Similar to the case with the doorknob, Natalia not only puts herself but others at risk when she contaminates the keyboard with the remaining acid that's on her gloves. However, if Natalia has removed her gloves before using the keyboard, no contamination will occur. So type away, girl! We hope that this video has taught you when not to use gloves.